Yeah, how do you like where your youth and depth, uh, your speed and your depth is with all these young guys out there? Hey, that's good to see, you know, um, able to roll guys and, and, and situationally um, do some things with some guys that we think might help us, um, keeping guys fresh. Um, you know, still making some mistakes, but that's – I got to be careful what I do with them, especially this early in the season. And uh, But I've been pleased with them. What have you seen from Armani Watts this camp? You know, Armani's a guy that has got a lot of range. He's a good tackler. Uh, and to play the middle of the field, that's what you got to have. You know, you have to have that. And, you know, again, Armani's learning the game. He's learning our system. Uh, I've, I've been pleased with Howard helping him out there, you know, uh, getting him lined up. Because when he gets lined up and knows what he's doing, uh, like I said, he's got really good range and he's a really good open field tackler. And he's got great ball skills and, and really good hops, too, really good leaps. What does he have to do over the next week, week and a half, to secure that spot? Keep doing what he's doing. Coach, what part of his defense has improved so far, the most through fall camp? Well, we'll see. You know, just 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 running to the ball, all of them running to the ball. I mean, we're getting population to the ball uh, every day, and we're able to show examples every day of, you know, what would be an explosive, not being an explosive, a big play. That's an, we call that an explosive um, because guys are running to the ball, and, and typically when you get a lot of guys to the ball, that creates turnovers too. You know, you have an opportunity to to knock the ball out. So that's been the biggest thing, just guys being able to stay fresh. You see them get a little winded, you roll into the next group, first opportunity you get. I know you said about a week ago the talk's cheap, but what gives you the most confidence that you guys are going to be able to take a step forward come August 20th? Um, you know, I, again, I, I just think the overall athleticism, we, we, we've scaled down the game plan a little bit this first week and, and let those guys go hunt, you know, let them go do their job and uh, uh, use their athleticism, and, and we're going to have to tackle. That's the key, you know. This game we're going to have to tackle, and we'll talk about that more Wednesday, but not giving up the big explosive play and tackling in the back end. What's the main improvements you've seen in Kenny Hill in the time that he's arrived here, you know, going against Well, him? you know, just, well, <laughs> to me, we throw a lot of stuff at our offense um, every day at practice. And, and Kenny, Kenny understands that. Um, he knows what play to get the offense into. Now, he goes against us every day, too. But just the ability to, to change the play uh, and get them in the right play, it seems like he's done a really good job of that. Coach, you talk about the importance of the Mike linebacker position. Jordan and, and the rest of the guys, have you seen progression from them since they've come into fall camp? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're getting more and more comfortable. I mean, the more they play, the more comfortable they're going to get. And, uh, yeah, I've seen uh, continued growth, no doubt. Mike, uh, Mark, um, Ivan Robinson has been a, a feel-good story. Mm -hmm. This guy was retired a couple months ago. Right. What have you seen from him so far? Uh, Buy-in factor, big body that can move, going to help us, like being that depth. Uh, when the team try to go big on us, he's the guy that, that you know, him and Zay Coven right now are the two big guys in there that got a little twitch and basically still hold the point. And that's that's uh, that's pleasing. I mean, that's makes you sleep well at night knowing that you have that. Going to South Carolina, who do you think is going to start on that defensive line? I know you're going to rotate a lot of bodies mm -hmm. in, but who do you expect? I think to start? we're releasing the depth chart Wednesday. All right. Now, now that Alonzo's carrying some more weight, how is he carrying? Good, good, good. I mean, you know, again, we'll see when we get into the game. Uh, he may be a little bit like Ivan. So far, he has been. We'll see when he's got 340, 50 pounds leaning on him uh, every play. But so far, so good.